Hello, I'm Andy and I'm going to read to you a weekly horoscope from the 10th of September to the 16th of September and this is for you coming from Aquarius. So let's start from the 10th. Now that's going to be a Sunday and it's going to be programmed as a very difficult morning, afternoon and early evening period. And some of these planets want to even creep into the nightfall period to make it bad for you. So it all depends on you now. You cannot afford to be arrogant. You cannot afford to be different in the sense that wanting to change plans made by others. You cannot afford to say things and be critical and wanting to criticize other people. So improve your tolerance for everything around you. And that way you can lessen these planets who, for, who want to create a lot of problems for you in the morning, afternoon and early evening period. The evening and nightfall period, some emotional planets come in. They are not your best, but at least they lessen the fury of your negative planets. So some solutions may be able to be found in the evening nightfall session. These emotional planets can make you be feeling very hurtful. And so if you need to be on your own, maybe that's the best way to do it. If you are going to socialize, these planets who earlier part of the day make you arrogant may also move in there. So be on your best behavior. The 11th, which is a Monday, starts in a very emotional way. So you are oversensitive and you want to plan changes and you want to make up your mind about how you want the changes to happen. But let others take the lead would be my advice. That way the finger of blame will never point at you. Keep a low profile. Come up with your ideas. You've got some creative ideas on this 11th, which is a Monday. But try to keep a low profile and you'll be doing well enough. There are planets that make you dominating, make you stubborn as well. So if you let them take the, take the in charge, then you're going to have difficulties that way. So again, let others take the lead. Evening nightfall period, these planets can make you more dominating and more stubborn. And if you don't have to socialize, go back to the safety of your own home. But if you have to be out, plans already made, whether for business or whether for job-wise socializing, or whether with your loved ones, you have to remind yourself, do not be stubborn and do not dominate. That way, it will be a good enough evening and nightfall period. Let's go to the 12th, which again starts in a very dominating and stubborn way. These planets are anchored for a while. So, even leaving home, you are finding differences and you are being criticizing. Or when you are driving, you may be very stubborn and that gets you into trouble when you are driving. Or at your place of work or in business, you are not bending enough, you are unbending and therefore seen as a person not negotiable and too stubborn. Don't allow any of this to happen. And that way you will find some good results can creep in in the morning, afternoon and early evening period. The evening and nightfall period improves a lot. And so solutions will be found and you will be able to do things extremely well and in a very lucky way. So socialize with business in mind. Socialize with wanting to be with your colleagues or with your bosses to get their support for anything. Socialize with your marriage or your romance partner and solutions will come very nicely your way. Let's go to the 13th which starts brilliantly for you. Plenty of good news waiting for you on the Wednesday of the 13th at your place of work or in business. Be on your toes. These are very fast planets. They come with opportunities. If you're not ready, they just move away again. So make your phone call, send your emails, ask favors, communicate and communicate. You will see something good can brew very nicely for you. Morning, afternoon and early evening. The evening and nightfall period, these planets move on to make you lucky as well. But one planet moves in that makes you stubborn and dominating. So as long as you don't let this planet be too active, you are going to have a good enough uh, evening and nightfall period. I like your 14th of September, which is a Thursday, extremely well. The whole 24 hours are given to you to bring success in all areas of your life. Morning, afternoon and evening planets, plenty of business planets are there, plenty of job planets are there. So you will find solutions to improve your job, improve your business areas, improve your communication with the people you love as well. So communicate and communicate and you will find solutions where perhaps a couple of days ago you couldn't. And you are going to get good news in business, you are going to get good news in career. 
Evening nightfall period also very good. So good to socialize. Now in the evening nightfall period, you get unexpected good news or unexpected good meetings as well. So dress well, look good because you're going to meet with somebody, whether for business, whether for career, whether for love or romance or to improve your marriage, all can be done. So what a wonderful 24 hours you have on the 14th, which is a Thursday. The 15th, the 15th, another wonderful 24 hours. Morning, afternoon, evening, night is a Friday. At your place of work, you will excel. At your In business, you will also excel and attract the support of uh, business contacts and business contracts. With your loved ones, you will be also found to be a favorite. So use every hour to go out and get what you want. Is it love? Is it romance? Is it marriage that you want to improve? Is it business? Is it career? You're going to have very good results because the evening nightfall session also shows business planners there. So mix business and pleasure. Go out with your colleagues, go out with your bosses or with those you love. Plenty of good news comes. 16th. The 16th starts very badly for you. It's a Saturday. Morning, afternoon, early evening periods, whatever can go wrong, want to go wrong. So you are in charge. Be careful what you say, be careful what you do. Do not expose yourself to become suspicious uh, in the sense that others suspect you of doing something. And be careful, don't drink too much and drive. Make sure you drive carefully because accidents are also possible. And also some secrets or something of the past may come up again to bring differences between you and whoever you are with. Now, your evening nightfall session improves a lot. So uh, solutions will come in the evening nightfall session. So be patient, lie low, don't make matters worse in the morning, afternoon and early evening period. That way the evening and nightfall planets will have the chance to make your situation better. Now these negative planets who trouble you in the morning, afternoon, evening period want to move in during the night period as well. So make sure you don't drink too much and drive very carefully. And be careful of the company you are with. Well, that's the week for you. I'm already Skyping and I'm charging USD 50.50 for a 90-minute Skype session with me. That will be based on your date of birth and your time of birth and looking at your palms. That's very intense. And I will also use tarot cards if you want me to in the 90 minutes and I'll face read you as well while we Skype. So go to Facebook or go to Skype or leave me an email and I'll come back to you. Make your mind up when you want to Skype and I'll be able to help you for your next five or six years in all areas of your life. Until then, thank you and good luck.